This week's episode of the Fast and Frugal Shopping Challenge comes from Shakti Stores Brighton, which is a seaside town in the south of England. Our three participants are all interested in healthy eating and reducing the environmental impact of their shopping. So we thought that this week we'd set our participants a green challenge. What they have to do is select as quickly as they can one packet of butter that's not only low in salt, but also low in food miles. So let's meet our participants. This is Jerry. She always reads product labels when she's shopping. That is, as long as she remembers her glasses. This is Chris. Nicknamed App Man by his friends, he's got an app for everything on his smartphone. And finally, here's Rachel. She's going to be using the Lambent Shopping Trolley, a new technology. Let's hope it's easier to use than it is to say. So first up is Jerry. She selected a packet of butter and needs to get her glasses on to read the label. Where are those glasses? Ah, here they are. No, they're not. Maybe in the other glasses case, Jerry? Okay, now she's ready. Jerry's looking for the salt content and the country of origin. It's not always easy to find this information on the label and it can be difficult to read as you get a bit older. This might take a while. Why don't we go and see how Chris did? And here he is coming into the shop. And he's wearing shorts. Apparently very trendy according to his latest fashion app. Out comes the smartphone and he's loading his shopping information app. Now he's using the camera to read the barcode on the packet of butter. Seems to be tricky getting the right distance. He doesn't seem too impressed with the product information the app is giving him. But he's not called App Man for nothing. And he's going to try again with another packet of butter. It can take a while to read that barcode, can't it, Chris? Another drawback with a smartphone is that it only leaves one hand free, but Atman is showing impressive butter balancing skills. Again, Chris doesn't seem too impressed with the information he's getting from his smartphone app. This could also take a while. Why don't we go and see how Rachel did? Here's Rachel going into the supermarket. Unlike Jerry and Chris, she's got a lambent shopping handle clipped onto her trolley. She selects a packet of butter, scans it, and almost straight away it seems she knows whether it's low salt and how many food miles it has. That's so fast and frugal, it's almost cheating. So how does the Lambent shopping trolley handle work? The built-in scanner reads the product barcode and then LEDs light up on the handle to display product information. In this example, the more LEDs that light up, the greater the number of food miles. If the lights are orange, then the product is high salt. And if they're green, then it's low salt. What about the emoticon display? It tracks the average value of all the products in the trolley. For example, food miles. The trolley average is then compared to a norm. For example, an average Brighton shopper. If the trolley average is better than the norm, then the shopper sees a smiley icon. If they're around the average, the emoticon is neutral. And if the trolley average is worse than the norm, then a sad emoticon appears. Okay, enough tech talk. Back to Shakti stores and the fast and frugal shopping challenge. I think Rachel's scanning her last packet of butter. And she's found the product that's low in salt and low in food miles. How's Chris doing? Oh, still trying to find product information. Careful with that butter, Chris. And what's Jerry doing? 
She's meditating. No, no, she's reading the product labels. So this week's winner is Rachel with the Lambent Shopping Trolley. And her prize is 250 grams of spreadable, low salt, low food miles butter. Next week, the Fast and Frugal Shopping Challenge will be in Glasgow, Scottish tropical paradise, where participants will be searching the city for the deep fried Mars bar with the highest fat content.